Hello everybody. Hello to all the children and parents who are going through the sacramental programme this year. Uh, Father Anthony has asked me just to send a little message to you um, on his behalf to say to you that he hasn't forgotten you. I also want to say that all the parish catechists are obviously missing you and uh, wanting to send you their good wishes too. It's been quite a disappointing time for you because at this time of year your children uh, would have been going through their first communions. They'd been receiving that wonderful sacrament for the first time. And I know that's very disappointing for you parents, but, uh, but most of all for the children. So we, we appreciate how you must be feeling at this time. Uh, so we haven't forgotten you and we've been trying to... Um, establish some sort of plan for what we can do going forward. Clearly with the continued closure of churches for mass, um, we can't give you a date yet until things are clearer from the government about when it might be possible to bring larger numbers together in church. Shortly uh, we may be able to open church for private prayer so there'll be more details about that coming out but certainly for the First Communion services, it doesn't look as though that's possible at the moment. So today I just want you to encourage you uh, in the things it can be doing in the meantime until we can actually inform you that that's possible. We want to encourage you to reconnect or to connect fully with the parish activities that are going on um, through YouTube and Facebook so there are some things going on if you're not aware of it, some of you will be maybe, but some may not know that every week we are having streamed, live streamed masses th through our Facebook page and through YouTube. So there is a 9.30 mass Tuesday to Saturday every day and of course we have Sunday mass at 10.30 in the morning. You can find these on the YouTube channel uh, if you go into YouTube and search for M Carmel hyphen J Bosco and you will find all the activities that are being posted there. So the masses, there are devotions and prayers, prayer times being filmed and you can get them all there. Alternatively, you can find them on our Facebook page um, which is the Our Lady of Mount Carmel with St John Bosco Blakely. Facebook page. So please have a look at what's there because there's a lot of information there on both those that are both on the Facebook page and um, also our parish website as well um, which you can google obviously for St John Bosco, for Mount Carmel and St John Bosco Blakely. So you'll find links to everything there. So see what you can find out from there and you'll keep updated about what's happening with the sacramental program also through those to particularly through the Facebook and the uh, um, parish website. So keep keep working at that, keep having a look at that. We are hoping soon to start issuing the remaining sessions material that we hadn't got to. There were three more sessions to do. And we have a plan um, to actually um, film some little video clips to help you through each session. So that will be issued to you through, um, you know, again, through the Facebook page um, and on, on the YouTube channel. It should be possible to do that, too. And we will issue the materials through the school, through both schools. But also, if your child isn't in either of our parish schools, then we will contact you directly and uh, advise you about how you can get your materials. So I hope that helps you to feel that we are still working on your behalf and trying to support you. Um, you can also obviously contact either the schools for more information or the face, through the Facebook page. Um, and there are there's information on the parish website about who you can contact for more details. But we'll keep you informed, we'll keep you updated. And as soon as we can make a plan for how we might um, allow your child to receive that wonderful sacrament of First Communion, we will be in touch. So, all the very best to you, and we will keep praying for you. Please keep praying for Father Anthony and all the parish too. 
and try and keep praying with your child. That's the most important thing at this time. And keep safe, everybody.